Hello again. What do you need to talk about? I just left Trinity Church. And I was thinking about Finn. And... Tell me about it. She saved my life and yours. Everybody's. She's the one who put us in danger in the first place. But after seeing what happened to Rick, I get why she did it. People are messy. Take your Uncle Aaron. He's the reason Krieger's in jail. And he helped us get people out of Harlem. But every time I look at him, I think of all the pain he put your dad through. Yeah. You don't need to make a judgment on Finn's life, Miho. Or her death. Just remember who she was, and why you loved her. You always know what to say. <laughs> That's my job. Call me back if you need me. And the ending. Si. Te quiero. Miles. I'm catching up on... yikes. Kind of a backlog after being away for a few weeks. No rest for the Spider-Man? Nope. Speaking of which, I'm not gonna be swinging behind you constantly looking over your shoulder now that I'm back. I trust you. And I have some stuff I should take care of. Like what? Can I help? I need to find a job. Freelancing with the Bugle was great, but I'd like something steady. Have you thought about teaching? You're pretty good at it. <laughs> Honestly, no. No. Maybe. I'll think about it. Call you soon. This sound always feels like someone celebrating. Even when it's just telling time. Your dad thought so too, so he had to include it. A sound that tells time. Okay. back there. He said it sounded like a celebration. I'm not gonna find it over here.
I'm celebrating. That's it. Ringing on the hour. When I hear those bells, I remember the last time I was here. Your dad had just graduated from the police academy. I didn't go to the ceremony, so I met him here after. I bought us milkshakes. Strawberries for him, peanut butter for me. I don't know why I remember that. He said he couldn't cover for me anymore if I got in trouble. I told him I was done with that life. I was lying, but he believed me for a while. Or at least pretended to. Man, things got complicated between them. Hey, I got word there's an out-of-control helicopter in your area. Something is seriously wrong with that helicopter. Time to hero up. I can't believe I'm saying this. Don't hack helicopters. I can't. Someone's jammed the controls. Three signals controlling the hack. Next. A few more transmitters, and the helicopter will be okay. I'll fix it. Okay, helicopter unhacked. Never thought I'd say this, but thanks, Spider Man. You can go this time.
this plaza and the blocks around it are alive with sound. What you're looking for is light, distinct. Light, huh? Okay. Eh, should keep looking. <laughs> Something distinctive. I like that beat. I'm not sure it's light, though. something else. <laughs> what? Probably something you don't usually hear in the city. Spider-Man. Careful! too far away. This is crazy. Then try next week? Ha <laughs> ha! And next time. Difficult. Not this way. I think it's back there. That sounds good. This plaza is where I had my first job. I was fresh out of high school then. Didn't have the gear or the mask. The guy paid me to mug the boss. Rough him up, take everything in his walk. Your dad found out. He stood under those wind chimes yelling at me for an hour. He never told our folks. He made me promise I'd stop stealing. Wish I kept my word. Better. I wish you had too. Maybe you and Dad would have stayed close. And you and I would be okay too. Man. Hey y'all, 
it has been a good week for Harlem. Spider-Man stopped the Tinkerer, Rio Morales with Electric City Council, Rockland Plaza is closed for good, and Simon Krieger is in jail. Woo! <laughs> Bonus, I passed my citizenship test with flying colors! Still love you, China. Gonna miss your candy. Okay, back to business. In an attempt to save face, Roxanne's board released all of Krieger's personal documents. Memos, emails, real monster. Well, I'm combing through those docs, and I'll be playing unreleased, free recorded texts. Fresh material coming in a few weeks, and in the meantime, remember to sing to your friends while you water them. Okay, bye! See you soon! Are for paintball. How long you been an arm? You lose your job before or after? Why can't you sell something nice? Like stickers or pizza? Be more subtle next time. Or, you know, just don't do crimes. Times Square. Easy to find someone in the crowd here. Or lose them. Sounds you need's like an electric current. A current? I could cheat it with venom. <laughs> nah. How alive that feels. After I started calling myself the problem, met my first client right under this sign. Neon flags hard to miss. The crowd makes it easy to blend in. He wanted me to steal a painting. I looked across the square and saw your dad looking back at me. He never said anything. He just turned and left. He didn't know everything. Just that I was a thief. That was enough. I think he saw where we were headed long before I did. If he would have tried to act right sooner, he would have forgiven you. I know he would have. Messing with a billboard, FYI. This is a good one. Me and your dad used to hang around here. Listen while the whole station came alive. That's what you need. Something at the station. it over here.
fire station. Hanging around here is how your dad got the idea to be a cop. I said, man, you're not uptight enough for that job. But he wanted to make things better from the inside. Pretty sure he died trying. You did make things better, Dad. And so will I. since the disaster on Braithwaite Bridge. For good reason. The kid screwed things up so bad, even the original model would have blushed redder than his costume. The classic one, not that ugly new thing. But today, I must also acknowledge that the city is rallying around this youngster and proclaiming him uh, a hero. <sighs> With an unstable energy source on the verge of wiping Harlem off the map, this youthful Spider-Man reportedly stepped in and saved lives. Or at least that's what his supporters want us to think. The real truth is that none of this would have happened if he hadn't donned a ridiculous suit and started swinging willy-nilly around the city performing reckless acts of violence. Hero? More like zero? Ha! Jared, open up the lines. I want to hear from those who agree with me. Jared, I said open up the lines. <laughs> what do you mean they're open? Well, something must be wrong. Folks, we're having technical difficulties. Please stand by. This one was all your dad's idea. You need something that's always in this park. Quiet on their own. Loud in a group. Loud in a group? Uh... Hmm. Hot dog vendors would be loud in a group, but I don't think that's right. I think it's back there. something you'd always find here like birds or trees or no no not trees birds around here maybe I'm not gonna find it over here
Maybe, but it's probably too quiet to work well. Too far away. Not this way. Probably something you'd always find here. Like birds or trees or... No, no, not trees.
pretty sure it's behind me. Pretty sure it's behind me. Think it's back there. Not this way. There's a lot of birds around here. Maybe?
dad record this? Is he a pigeon whisperer? This was way back, before high school. We were hanging in the park one day, and someone dropped a hot dog. You know how that goes. Place was swarming with pigeons. Dad stopped cold. He said, Aaron, man, that's music. Listen. Next day, we were crawling all over Manhattan looking for beats. Like you are now. I remember the first time they showed me how to sample. Uncle Aaron had the ear, and Dad had the ear for music. split an atom from the comfort of your own home? That's next on my to-do list. No, speed not a gun. Collision model is updated, projectile physics is fixed, frame rate stabilized. It's awesome now. Which means I can play it? Uh, it still needs textures. Sound effects, music, VO. I'll write the music. I could probably do sound effects too. First we improve and design our own spider suit. Now we build a mobile game empire? We're unstoppable. Never doubted it. I'm not doing spider things. When I get home, I'll set up a task board, start tracking out sound effects you'll need. Ooh, and sketching out a score. Yeah, woo! Can you feel that? That's me fist bumping you from afar. Later, dude. Your mom lived here right after college. You know that? She and your dad were dating. Three of us spent a lot of time here. We got used to this soft, steady beat. Soft beat. Rhythm, rhythm. Something that's been around a while. Too squeaky. Don't think that'll work. Yeah, it's subtle, but it could be. Things were good back then. Felt like they'd be good forever. Your mom got her first gig as a teacher. Your dad was new to being a cop, and I just started calling myself the proud. I figured we all kept secrets about our jobs. But last, 
Your dad's job and mine crossed paths. What? Man, Uncle Aaron, if you would have been anything else, my mom and dad would have supported you all the way. MJ's front page are about some caria. Not while you were swinging, I hope. Uh, sorry. Scolding mentor mode downshift me. What did you think of the article? The article was great. The pictures? Eh. Where did they get this Peter Parker guy? <laughs> I'm sure MJ asks her stuff that all the time. So how was the trip? Did you have to suit up while you were out there? Nah. Sable handled it like a champ. Her and her wild pack. I mostly got to stand around taking pictures. It sounds like a nice break. As much as a work trip can be. Oh, yeah. I'm feeling refreshed and ready to do some next-level spider man -ing. And clean out the gutters at my house. <laughs> Being a homeowner is glamorous, let me tell you. Sounds like it. I'll let you go. Talk soon. What the... What do you think we'll find in there? Are you kidding me right now? Nothing in there is worth like Spider-Man! Not today, burglars. Time to teach you a lesson! And I better not see you trying to break in again. Yeah. Yeah, that sounded good. Dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when Dad and Uncle Aaron were little. Pretty sure it's behind me. This one's rhythmic. Comes on a schedule. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when Dad and Uncle Aaron were little. I'm not gonna find it over here.
Maybe something mechanical? Hmm. There's pretty sure it's behind me. This one's rhythm. Comes on a schedule. Okay. Something rhythmic that was around when Dad and Uncle Aaron were little. Yeah, that's it. You probably don't know this, but your dad and I grew up not far from here, before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Hearing the clatter of the wheels, the squealing when the trains turn and stop. Always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space agent. Your dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker. But he always wanted to help you. Yeah, sounds like that. Hey, Miles. I know you're gonna hear a lot about me. Things I've done, now that I'm serving time. I cut a plea deal, so it shouldn't be more than two years. But getting out early, it's not why I gave up Krieger. You told me you had to be better. And that meant looking out for other people, even if it cost you something. I don't have a lot of practice. But I'm trying. Thanks, kid, for making me a better man that I could be on my own. Take care out there. Love you, Unc. I couldn't believe this. Wow. How cool! Have fun with this one. I had a repeat client I always met here. Got real used to waiting. Listen, hearing this sound running on a tight schedule. A sound on a schedule?
Too far away. Oh the sound of something on a schedule. Whoa, alliteration. Aaron sitting and listening, what would I hear? Cool, but that happens all day. Not at specific times. I'm going to leave the subway portion again. I still walk anyway. Coming down. There's a step. Yeah, that's cool. <sighs> Not gonna find it over here.
fairy horns. That's right. The client I met here used to take the ferry over from Jersey. Look for him was good money. Could have got busted. He's how your dad found out about the problem. Not that it was me, but that a thief was making it big in New York. And your dad volunteered for the case. I could feel him closing in. I had to try and guess which would be worse. I told him. I caught him. Better be me. I... I don't know what I'd do. That can't be the only reason Dad cut him off. Not if he fessed up. It just wasn't Dad. Hey, young blood. You got almost everything you need for the track. You just unlocked the spot where you could find the last piece. What we worked for you. Place where I fought him? Doesn't have the best memories, Uncle Aaron. Yeah. Got away. Hope the cops get them. by newly elected councilwoman Rio Morales of Park, who has been instrumental in the effort to scale back Roxxon's expansion plans following the revelations that they endangered New Yorkers with their highly unstable energy source, Newport. Welcome, councilwoman. Thanks for having me, Mr. Jameson. I have to say, I was surprised when you reached out to my office. My producer, Jared, was insistent to have you Something about needing to broaden our demographics, especially after your recent appearance on another much less popular show. Oh, yeah. Danica Hart was one. My listeners would like to know, how do you plan to bring prosperity to your community? I think I speak for everyone when I say it's an area that has struggled for quite some time. True prosperity isn't brought in from outside by huge faceless corporations. It comes from sustained investment in the people that make our community so special. It's true that folks here have struggled, but that's only because they've lacked advocates in City Hall. I will be their voice. And my hope is with that support, the city and the world will see that we're a vibrant area full of brilliant artists, kind people, and now, even our very own Spider-Man. How about that? You are now a publicly elected official. You are obligated to serve according to a constitution, laws, and time-tested ethical requirements, which I'm sure you respect. How can you reconcile that responsibility with your support of a vigilante who isn't bound by any of the same safeguards? Spider-Man is not our enemy. He's a New Yorker like the rest of us, and he's just trying to do what's right. And if you ask me, he couldn't be doing a better job. That doesn't replace my obligations to my community, nor anyone else's who serves in a public role. But I do sleep easier every night knowing that he's out there, helping us all pick up the slack. I'm happy to spend all day arguing why that sleep could easily become a nightmare. But we're out of time. And your approval polls are very high. So I'll just say thank you, Councilwoman. Jared will be sending you some lovely parting gifts, including my J. Jonah Java. The decaf substitute, doctors like mine are insisting they're patients of a certain age hey, drink. If you down it fast, you almost believe it's real coffee. Jameson out. Taking a break? I respect that. Thanks for being a friendly neighborhood superhero. We appreciate it. Excuse me. Seriously, I gotta get home and feed my cat. It's okay. Spider emergency. Whoa. I'm kind of jealous of his lair. The lab. The basement thing. 
always making upgrades. I definitely got my suit patching skills from Uncle Aaron. Uncle Aaron's got tabs all over the city. He must have been building his network for years. My mom bought him this at a flea market. It was a joke about... Uh, can't remember. Sequencer? Sampler? Vintage? Oh, has to be him and Dad's equipment. He was always way better at guitar than me. He used to come to our place for dinner all the time. Guess he never learned to cook. Maybe I should take a few swings. Nah, I'd probably break it. Use the sounds. Frequency lock? <laughs> Something new every day. Hey, kid. Hope the suit fits. You asked why me and your dad stopped talking. He was investigating the Prowler. It led him to my clients. People like Simon Krieger, Wilson Fisk. Dad couldn't afford to make enemies like that. Not with you and Rio in the picture. So I told him. Hoped he'd back off, and he did. For good. He didn't want me around. Didn't want you to turn out like me. Hope this suit helps you be better. Take care, Spider-Man. Thank you, Uncle Aaron. For everything. is shut down. Man, it's way too cold for people to be... ...on the street. Miles, figure out what's going on at Feast. Hey, Genki, I'm gonna talk to Gloria about Feast, as me, not Spider-Man. Undercover by not being undercover. I like it. Hey, Gloria. What's going on? Why is everyone outside? A pipe burst. We cleaned it up, but the city won't let us reopen till the plumbing's fixed. I've had it repaired three times, but it keeps breaking down. Can you send people to other fee shelters? They're at capacity. Everyone here, they've got nowhere else to go. We're trying to keep people warm and fed. But in this weather... Anything I can do to help? Yeah, actually. C 
Could you check on the people camped in the park? They don't always open up to management. Happy to. Then get back to your vacation. You work too hard. Yeah, yeah. I was at the other shelter for I need to figure out what happened with the water. Maybe someone here knows. I'm done with this when I came to feast. Not a fan of camping? I'll get that. Thank you. I'm Steph, Gloria's girlfriend. I'm volunteering at Feast. Or what's left of it. Yeah. Gloria said the city won't reopen the building. They're being unusually stubborn. And they showed up so fast to condemn us, less than an hour after the flood. Uh, I, I sound like I should be wearing a, a tinfoil hat, huh? No, that's weird. Well, listen. Thanks for your help. Okay. Suspicious. I should keep talking to people. Maybe I can fix this. What do you think happened? With the flood? Hey there. Did I overhear you talking about someone from the city? Yeah. About a month ago. Shelter put in a new water heater. Inspector came by. He said we were in good shape. Then all this went down. Yeah. You'd think you'd catch that. I gotta run. Stay warm. You too. Blankets. Or maybe food. Heavy food. Yeah, well, if you set it down... <clears throat> Here. I got you. Thanks, man. I'm trying to keep this stuff dry. I was so worried we'd get robbed, and the flood happened. I even bought a knife. Why did you think that? Got some guys casing the place. Chased them off, but they just came back. Then they up and disappeared right before the flood. Huh. Well, let me know if you need anything else. Be careful with that knife. Can do. Thanks. Hey, you busy? Working on speed Nonagon. What'd you find? Guys were casing feasts right before it flooded. The city swooped in like suspiciously fast to condemn the building, and an inspector said the pipes were fine right before one burst. You think sabotage? Definitely. Need to change into my suit. This time last year, I swore to... I should change. Gloria said the city will reopen the shelter if the pipes are fixed. Let's see if I can pull it off. to a storm drain. <laughs> Clogged by... Ugh, crash. And no wonder the pipe burst. Cleared the trash. I don't think the water's right. Oh, I know how to fix it. You gotta find the pump station. How do you know that? I did a clean up the rivers project in fourth grade. So they're sparkling clean now? Well, cleaner. Do not go in the Hudson. Not that way. I fought at the power station. Okay, I get the bank heist and the power station, but 
Why mess with Feast? Let's find out. You think he'll start running protection again? Uh, once he's settled in, sure. He's have a good grip on this place first. Hey, ain't that why we're here? You gotta give it to the boss. He's the only one smart enough to pull off this whole thing. Unless we get caught. If we do, we say nothing. Big guy rewards loyalty. Not how I plan to spend the holidays, dumping trash and storm drains. No kidding. Who even came up with this? Higher ups has to shut the place down. Tommy had pipes in there. I think he used to work for sewage. Some make gusto. Turn on the pump. Hey, clean up the rivers guy. Pump's pressure is in the red. Looks like they messed with the valves. You'll have to reset them individually before you can turn on the pump. Did you hear those guys? Their boss wants to run crime in Harlem. Drugs, protection. Ugh, can't people just visit for the food and museums and not make a mess? Non-Spider-Man related question. Have you started Jane Eyre for Miss Maller's class? I haven't done any homework since school let out. It's wild. I just finished this wedding scene and... <sighs> can't put it down. Are you reading right now? I thought you were helping me. Uh, yep, nope, I I'm here. You have my undivided attention. <laughs> as soon as I finish this chapter. Five minutes. Dude! This one's got a pressure meter. Probably means it's old. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. Ah, I gotta web it. Need the water pressure right in the middle, or I could rupture the pipes again. Wait for it to drop. <laughs> Won't work till the pressure drops.
Gotta wait for more pressure. One valve down, two to go. Behind trash. Cool. That's two. One more, and I can turn the water back on. These guys are everywhere! Hey guys! Wanna tell me who your boss is? No? Okay, fine! Get so good, Spider-Man! This here's a private business venture! Just walk away! You don't want to trust the guy we answer to! This is why we don't mess with shelters! If you all left Harlem alone, I'd leave you alone! Maybe! You could always run! Now for the pressure valve. Should be fixed. I need to turn on the water at the pump station. Hey, Genki, can you call the city? Get them to send someone to Feast North and declare it uncondemned. One official sounding call from a high school student pretending to be an adult coming up. Turn up the goon squad. Need to get rid of these guys. Never actually been to Gotta watch out for spiders, man. Bites the dust. That'll leave a mark.
can do it. Hey, man. I just overheard. Their boss is in the raft. Oh, whoa. Right side? Maybe we can cut off however he's communicating with people on the outside. I'll look into it. Now we gotta turn on the water. Water coming on. Now. Great timing. City inspector just got the feast. Should be able to reopen soon. Cool. I'm gonna head there and make sure Gloria's got everything she needs. So, reasons for the boss of this whole shady operation to go after Feast. One, the land it's on, prime real estate. Two, having a shelter in Harlem reduces crime, like, a lot. And if he wants to be a crime boss, he actually needs crime to boss around. Exactly. But we stopped him. Go team! Hey there. Oh, Spider-Man. Hi. Always happy to meet one of you guys. Oh, uh, <clears throat> yeah, listen, I was fixing the water system and I noticed your shelter was affected. Should be fixed now, though. That was you? Inspector just came by, said we're good to open. Everyone can go inside. Ah, oh, Spider-Man, you've got perfect timing. Don't know how much longer we would have held out. Thank you. Hey, Gloria. It's Miles. I heard Feast North is open again. We had a little help from Spider-Man, if you can believe it. Thanks for stopping by. People in the park said you helped a lot. Happy to. Now get back to your winter break. We'll see you when school starts back up. All right. Bye. I've been talking to a local street artist named Haley. She has a lead on where this whole bad guy Harlem takeover operation is set up. That's awesome! Where can I find her? She's super busy helping plan the King's Day Parade, but I'll post to the app as soon as she's free. Oh, you've met her. Before the rally, remember? Street artist, uses sign language. Oh yeah! She's cool. I'll look out for your post. Cool. Talk later. into JFK next Tuesday. You mind covering patrol for me? No problem. She's been gone a while, huh? You must be glad she's coming back. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised Sable let her go. MJ's profile opened by calling her cold, calculating, and humorless. Lavish praise in Simcaria. They're basically BFFs now. <laughs> now that's a cool team-up. Cool and slightly frightening. Okay, hit you up Tuesday. Bye. And thanks again.
really need to sleep. Just a quick nap. It's a clue for a scavenger hunt. Dad and I used to do these. Did she make a new one? I'm gonna check this out. See what mom put together. Check it out of here. Check out the Natural History Museum.
After we won that science enterprise, Finn got way into space exploration. Dreamed up this moon transport. She wanted to reinvent the whole world. I haven't been to the museum in forever. I think the last time was with Finn and Dad. Those trips are really fun. It's weird to think about now. Street artist named Haley's got a lead on the people messing with Harlem. <laughs> she can always request it in the app. Uh, Genki said you could help me find the guys messing with Harlem? You followed them? It's dangerous. And brave. Uh, I'll, I'll go there. Try to shut them down. Hey man, 
then you told me where to find our criminal friend's setup. Hoping I could shut down however they're communicating with your boss. I'll check nearby cell phone towers. Do some network surveillance. See if I can figure it out so we can cut the connection. Dope. Call you when I'm there. Genki, guys are definitely set up here. Gonna clear them out. See if I can shut down this whole operation. Happy punching, Spider-Man. You talked to the big guy today? I was supposed to hop on a call with him in a few. Not your fault the kid Spider showed up and busted all our plans. All this guy cares about is results. But you've been with him for years. That's because I get results. Another win for Spider-Man. Final us, fighter! 
it's out for you. Oh my god! the dust. So peaceful, knocked out. Someone give me some extra eyes. Anyone else hear something? Come 
Someone come back me up! Don't you got bigger fish to front? Spider-Man! How are we supposed to fight him up there? to get inside. <laughs> Gotta be a way inside. Here should lift the door. Stay stuck. <laughs> Gotta wet the gear. Not what I expected. There's got to be more here. Footprints. That vanish. Okay. Do not push button. I'm gonna push it. Whoa. Hey, pulled network data. Webcam calls to the raft are definitely coming from here. So cut the network connection, brick the computer, no more boss giving them orders. Exactly. The underground basement hideout where they planned all their takedown Harlem schemes. Cool, cool, cool. Beast North? Caleb's Barbershop? The power plant? Everywhere they've targeted. Money, land, control. This guy wants everything. Ugh. Someone invested in a zoom lens. They're trying to find me. This is why Pete's always telling me to keep the mask on. Think I'll take this off their hands. Even without pulling off the bank heist, their boss is loaded. These guys really don't care who gets hurt, as long as their boss gets what he wants.
Can you help me run a hybrid attack? Sure. But first try V-A-N-E-S-S-A. -S -S Vanessa? If this setup belongs to who I think it does... What is this? Who are you? Oh, crap. Fisk! A child playing dress-up, pretending to be Spider-Man. I can sever the connection from here. Just keep him talking. Fisk. I stop what you're doing in Harlem. You're done in my neighborhood. Your neighborhood? How touching. You'll learn that when you cross me, the people you want to protect are the ones who suffer. What did that mean? I don't know. But we have to find out. I should head back to the park. Tell Haley I took care of these guys. Thanks for being a friendly neighborhood. Miles, Haley texted me. Fisk's guys are attacking CJ Walker Park. I thought I took them out. Some were scattered around the neighborhood. You've got to hurry, man. They're going after people at the party. Tell Haley I'm on my way.
<laughs> Don't worry about it. My home, too. I doubt that. Bye, Haley. Hope to see you again. Done in Harlem, thanks to us. And don't say no miles, thanks to you. <laughs> okay, you're right. We did it together. How's it feel to be Harlem's friendly neighborhood Spider-Man? Not gonna lie, pretty good. Oh, almost forgot to tell you. Danica Hart heard what we've been up to. She wants me to come on her show. Oh, that's awesome. You nervous? What should I wear? I don't think it matters, since it's a podcast. What if she can hear that I'm wearing sweatpants? What if she wants to hop on webcam? Oh my god, I, I, got, I gotta get ready. Uh, uh, bye. Hey, um, is this Spider-Man? It's Dale. From the bodega. Hope this is an okay time to call. It's Dale, by the way. <laughs> From the bodega. <laughs> hey, Dale. What's up, man? Hey, listen, Spider-Man. My Spider-Man, you know, my cat. He took a liking to you. Oh, yeah. I like him, too. Good cat. So, you know, I just wanted to say, if you wanted to come by and hang out with him sometime, or, like, take him for a walk or a swing or something, <laughs> you know, that, that'll be okay. That's all I'm saying. For sure. I'd love to chill with him. Thanks, Tail. Oh, man, that's great. I love, I mean, he'd love that. <laughs> Gonna tell him now. You're a good one, Spider-Man. See you soon. <laughs> Tail's great, man. I love that guy. Hey, good to see you. Been telling everyone how you saved Spider Man. You ready to swing, Spider Cat? You two look great. Get out there and stop some crimes, you two. the new Spider-Man. That's right, no censoring. That is how real we're getting. Recently, a woman from Harlem was kidnapped. Before the PDNY had even tracked her as missing, Spider-Man found her. Harlem's going through a rough patch since Roxxon moved in. I hope that having Spider-Man on their side gives them a little hope this holiday season. Listeners, give Spider-Man a shout out for me on your favorite social and donate to Rio Morales' campaign if you're into saving the neighborhood from corporate takeovers. And remember, clean your dryer filter after every load. Goodbye.
Christmas? Capsules in that tree planter. Used to sneak up here to stargaze. Never saw one until the 2016 blackout. And wow, the sky was full of them. Go to a doctor. Okay, Natural History Museum. Who on the postcard said, based in the park, with the world on our shoulders, we guard the next clue. Hmm. There's a statue of four guys holding a globe at the Central Park entrance. Might be what that clue means. are the backbone of America. They have no greater champion than J. Jonah James. But they have an enemy. Spice. Okay, Natural History Museum. Who on the postcard said, facing the park with the world on our shoulders. We guard the next clue. Hmm. Good work, dude, guys. I've seen that new Spider-Man swinging around Harlem. People dig our shit. 
I think he's got a standing discount on Caleb. Can't stand chat, Spidey. Too much to do. There's a statue of four guys holding a globe at the Central Park entrance. Might be what that clue means. Another postcard under here. Shouldn't you be like... Wow, that was intense. This one's of the Empire State Building. High atop the Empire State, you'll find a pair of blind eyes. There's a flash drive attached. Hey, big man. Happy birthday. Oh, my God. Yeah. Scavenger hunt seemed like a fun way to celebrate 16. Tour down memory lane. Remember that summer you and Finn forced me to take you to the museum every weekend? Yes. I love those trips. Used to be I felt guilty you didn't have any siblings. Things with your uncle are tough, man. But I would have never made it to 18 without him. Anytime I'd see you with Finn, I'd feel less guilty. You have a sister. Her. With Finn, now thank you. You'll always have family in your life. Love you lots, big man. See you at the next one. Wow. I haven't heard his voice in so long. I hope he left more messages with the rest of the scavenger, hunt. Huh? Hey, sleepyhead. Did you find my note? Yeah. I followed the clue. And just her dad. Did you do all this? Just the setup. Your dad made the clues last year. I know it's been tough since the move. Thought hearing from him could help. It does. Gracias, ma. De nada. Have fun with him. And remember, I'm here if you need me, Miles. You can tell me anything. Te quiero. Te quiero. Weapon steel going down nearby. Thank you, anonymous app user. Making a weapon steel out in the open like that? It's pretty bold. Oscorp, huh? You lose your job before or after that devil's breath mess? After. Oscorp's stock tanked hard. Good old Norm. He deserves it. Don't let him leave! He saw everything! I know Spidey taught me a quick for this. Stop, criminal! His bones will still break! Got you now! on weapons, Spider-Man style.
some? You drop some, I guess. Underground and locks on are fighting near innocent people. I said I knew someone who's looking into the underground. She's on the line. Hi, uh, Spider-Man. I'm Danica Hart. I'm planning a podcast series on the underground, and your, uh, your tech guy said you needed help with them. Oh, wow. Um, I'm a big fan. <coughs> I'm actually at one of their hideouts right now. Any advice? You're a fan? Wow. Okay. Uh, um, sorry. Um, their hideouts are radio dead zones, so police can't coordinate a raid. If you disable the jammers, I can alert the police and get them shut down. I'm on it. Thanks for the help, Danica. No one's getting past.
people are scared of us now. Hey, Jaina, how's it look? Jaina? Crap, someone make sure she's all right. Be right there. Or you could run away other people. That's an option. Come out and fight us! Hey, so despite the dead zone, I was able to ping an IP address, and it led me to an online underground forum, and it is gold. Really? Have you found anything good? Like how they started? They were wannabe mafia. Started with assaults and robberies, then went after bigger groups so they could earn a reputation. Like, oh, the inner demons. They go. Everybody, search. You don't scare me, Spider-Man. So after they made a run at the inner demons, how things go? Not how you'd expect. When Devil's Breath hit, enough of the underground got sick that they went into hiding. And Martin Lee going to jail ended the demons. Yeah, the underground took over the demons' territory kind of by default. Not very dramatic. We're not scared of you!
can't take us all, Spider-Man! Time, bro. Shaka or Tombstone? Kev, you there? Somebody check on him? I'll figure out what's going on. Or you could run away other people. That's an option. Hey, so despite the dead zone, I was able to ping an IP address and it led me to an online underground forum. And it is gold. Really? Have you found anything good? Like how they started? They were wannabe mafia. Started with assaults and robberies, then went after bigger groups so they could earn a reputation. Like, oh, the inner demons. Okay, Kev, who wins in a fight? Shaka or Tombstone? Kev, you there? 
Somebody check on him. Checking now. Good night. They're missing. Hey, Danica. So after they made a run at the inner demons, how things go? Not how you'd expect. When Devil's Breath hit, enough of the underground got sick that they went into hiding. So Martin Lee going to jail and in the demons. Yeah, the underground took over the demons' territory kind of by default. Not very dramatic. Come out here! Fight me! You're done. Manny, anything happening over there? Manny? Damn it. Someone go check on him. I've got it. What's the matter, Spidey? Scared? There. Now to find the jammer. I should be able to track the wires with my suit. Wire runouts. Probably a good place to start. Jammer could be behind that door. Yep. Demon stuff. Spools need to shut down the jammer. Hey, hideout's back on the grid. Nice. Tipping the cops off now. Oh, I can't wait to write up this underground demons conflict for my podcast series. Thanks, Spider-Man. That's my cue to leave.
Folks, the Feast Centers have had a rough go ever since their founder, Martin Lee, turned out to be the mad bomber known as Mr. Nick. But I believe the Feast Centers, because I knew them. The brave woman who literally gave her life to keep us going. So I was distressed to hear the Harlem branch recently suffered a damaging blow. With us is Laura, director of that center. Yeah, thanks. Uh, anyone who wants to donate to the cleanup, check out our website. It's tax deductible. Wonderful. I'm donating 10% of my paycheck for this week. Half of Jerry's. Now, I'm hearing Spider-Man may have been responsible for the flood. No way. Someone was responsible, but it wasn't Spider-Man. Follow the money. Who benefits from lower property values? And I'm going to stop you there, because we have a strict policy of not saying anything that will get me sued. Incidentally, I'm pretty sure Spider-Man can't afford lawyers. He wasn't Spider-Man. We're out of time. Thanks so much for joining us, Gloria. And remember, everyone, if you want to be a real hero, not like a certain masked menace, donate to Feast. Jared, cut her mic before I end up in the poorhouse.
Supplies are being stolen from a beast truck. I marked the location. Ah! <laughs> 